Thermal efficiency has become very important because from an end user's perspective, the phone or the tablet that a user is using gets so hot at times that uh, it becomes annoying. We have three devices, a Qualcomm-based phone and uh, two computer-based devices. The thermal camera shows the thermal footprint uh, that the three phones leave when running a CPU-intensive test. One way to show the results is via a heat map um, through a thermal camera. What we are trying to compare is thermal efficiency when the CPU is delivering peak performance. As you can see, the phone based on Qualcomm's chipset is much more thermally efficient compared to the competition. Another way of showing results is uh, by melting butter. Yeah, melting butter. Butter melts at 35 degrees uh, Celsius. As you can see, the phone based on Qualcomm's chipset is much more thermally efficient compared to the competition. One of the phones that is heating up the most is heating up to 55 degrees Celsius. That's hot, that's really hot. Qualcomm's Snapdragon S4 is the coolest kid on the block, and we mean it literally. <laughs>